One of my earliest video game memories was not knowing either... I don't remember if... Maybe we had one with a bug that was broken or something. But it may have just been this game. And I heard, you know, I heard later on that it's extremely cryptic. Like, you've got to sort of, like, read what to do and everything. Or it will take you a long time. So maybe there's a chance that's what it was. But Raiders of the Lost Ark. This little... Hearing the Atari theme song. <laughs> the Raiders, the... Indiana Jones theme song, it's like, oh yeah, man, it's like an early memory. Uh -huh. So today we're playing Raiders of the Lost Ark for the Atari 2600. And uh, I'll just stop that music right there. All right. So I mean, it's pretty the ambitious, these uh, things. Raiders like, the certain, Ark, like the, very so different from different Atari games. Like, sort of so much more it goes game, into it. It's it. not just like a one-screen thing. A as a kid, and it is impenetrable. It is so vague and so abstract. It's incredible. You have to read the manual to even get the slightest idea of what is going on in this game. Okay, so you can probably tell that's us. We're indie. Snakes are crawling down the screen, which will kill us in one hit. What's that big brown thing on the bottom? If you couldn't tell, that's the whip. What? I'm just gonna, oh, hold on, I almost got me. I'm just gonna select that whip, and now we can attack. See, that's the whip, that right there. We can kill snakes with it. Let's go down here. Okay, we're in the marketplace now. You remember the marketplace from the movie, right? can walk over the baskets. I got a gun, which is useless. Got a key. And uh, that thing is a grenade. If you couldn't tell, which of course you could not. 